So some of you may have seen a post that I put out just not that long ago, actually saying that we're, we're looking at doing a fair, a fair bit, or at least myself, a fair bit of traveling uh, this, this summer, little road trips, actual trips. But one of those trips is actually going to Alaska. We're doing an Alaska cruise. So of course, weirdly enough, as soon as I said that, you know, the Google, the Googles and the Alexas in my house just started being like, oh, well, you need to buy something like this. And some of those recommendations, I was like, okay. Um, and one of them was a tactical fleece. And we actually saw a tactical fleece by uh, Bearware, uh, which we were like, oh, that's kind of nice. Uh, and we actually um, have two of them coming. But I was like, they're not inexpensive. I guess they're, you know, fairly pricey. I want, I want to say fairly pricey until I actually went down to our local sporting store and looked at like a tactical fleece and realized how expensive those actually are. Um, so it's not actually that bad of a price. It's actually pretty good. Anyways, I went on Amazon because I'm like, well, maybe, you know, you can save yourself some money. And this is really something that we did for you guys because I bought one here and this is, this is Canadian dollars, right? It comes in about half the price of a bearware. Um, and 60 Canadian, $63. Okay. It actually comes in from the U S but, um, if you can save half the money, cause the Canadian bearware, I think it came out to 120 or $130, but if you can save some money, maybe this is a good option. Right now, four and a half stars, 739 reviews. Uh, all the images look like it should be should be pretty good. Free USA flag. That's not great for those of us in Canada. So it would be nice to see them maybe give you a Canadian flag, maybe. Um, but looks like lots of lots of pockets, pockets on the on the front, the back, the arms. You know, at half the price, maybe it's maybe it's really all you need. So I have I have the bag down here what it what it came in and uh we're going to take a look. Okay. Okay, so this can go down here. Um I should wear this watch with it. Remember this watch? I did this review of this watch a, a while back. If I can find the charger. That would be that would be a cool watch to wear with it all tactically. Anyways, this is this is the awesome packaging that it came in right here, right? You guys are seeing it. The good old Amazon bag. I, I didn't expect it to come in anything fancier than an Amazon bag, but it's a bag in a bag. It does have, you see it, you see it right there. US, US flag, hold on, hold on. That's better. We'll exchange that for sure, right? That's uh, better. Okay, anyways, this is it. I got it in the army green. It does come in a bunch of colors, and that that's kind of nice because, you know, some of those, some of them out there, they don't have uh, a lot of colors. So if you're someone that likes like different blues or you're you're one of the, the lady folks out there and you're like, oh, I would like something that's not like, I don't know, black or military green or whatever it is, you know? Um, so first off, patch, yes, it does come with it. So there you go. I'm changing that to this because represent, represent. Um, the big issue that I always have when you're buying coats and things like that uh, is that, are they gonna fit, right? So I had no idea. Um, the hood looks all right. It's, 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 everything feels fairly floppy. Um, thickness wise, I'd say it's okay. Um, like I, I honestly have heavier hoodies for sure. Like just normal hoodies, not a tactical hoodie than this one. They do have some nice features. Like I like the fact that this kind of comes over and covers the zipper, which is kind of nice. It does have a decent little pull tab on, on here. So if you're wearing gloves or you just need to get access to it, especially when it's covered, that's nice. Uh, zipper wise seems fine uh i don't know if it's any kind of fancy zipper right it is a w w c whatever that is it's a w c zipper i don't know um but you do get a nice 
a nice large pocket it seems on both sides so right when you right in here which is kind of nice it's a dual zipper so up and like down up, up all over the place and then of course um two patches so you can put a patch on this side patch on this side if where am I? if you so choose um this this i like though i don't think the other one has this this is kind of nice you can actually put a pen in here you can put a pen in here or you can put like i don't know a screwdriver maybe but definitely a pen maybe nothing overly long but um that's cool and pocket zipper pocket zipper zipper pocket what is this that's does that seem weird oh i bet you that's the back back of this so that ah i'm like why is that in there but that, that's deep you guys can see i got my hand pretty much all the way in there yes that's all right um this pocket down here not going to be as deep but you can kind of tell how deep it is by the actual you know the outline right here so still good and then it has thumb holes so the wrists themselves aren't aren't adjustable like there's no velcro or anything on it but it does have the thumb hole i actually like the thumb holes um, and then of course you have another pocket on this side and just one, just one pocket on this side, but again, a nice big pocket, which is cool. Uh, on the back, on the back, you have, on the back, you have a pocket and this pocket, of course, goes all the way through. So yeah, it's not like thick, thick for sure. Right. But all the way through. Um, so you're, if you're expecting a really thick hoodie, you know, just, it's, it's not that for sure. Um, I, at least I don't think it's thick, thick. Um, and then of course you have, I don't know what that's for. There's a, there's a Velcro right here. You guys see that? It's right on the bottom Velcro. I don't, is there Velcro on the other side? Nope. Just over there. That's weird. That's strange. Uh, inside wise, inside, uh, yeah. You get a you get another pocket here like that's a big pocket like that's a really big pocket right there you know pocket right there and and on the other side do you get anything uh yeah another pocket yeah right that's right it's got lots of pockets and you can see double double xl because that's you i usually wear an xl to double xl somewhere in that range because uh, what that's gonna fit that's gonna fit all right i think you know, I usually get that size because, um, especially something like this, I'm going to want to wear layered. Okay. So that's good. I got the zipper down on this one. It's nice. It's actually nice. Once it's on, it feels, it's funny. It feels thicker when it's on. It's thicker when it's on. Um, zippers on the, this, this side, which is nice. I'm just going to do this up. So it's, that's a good size. I'm curious, like down They're, like they are fairly big pockets right which is kind of nice it's not a it's not a bad placement okay the green green's nice hold on nope wrong one right one there we go boom <laughs> yes indeed okay hood let's see the hood yeah it's it's got some warmth to it i think so there's the hood it's a floppy hood Right, this comes up like this, so you get a decent coverage. But yeah, you can see like it's it's a good size hood. The brims, I you know, especially if you were in a baseball hat too, I think that'll be nice. Nothing here to cinch the hood though. There's nothing to get the hood nice and snug if you want it snug, right? So that's that's not happening. Um, I do think it has. Let's see, you guys seeing waist down, right? It does have little cinches is it just on one side no both sides so if you want to you can cinch the bottoms here to get those tighter all right just gonna snug that up get that tight in there yes yes okay that's a that'd be a great place for for gloves and stuff like that. I put gloves in there. Anything that you're not going to accidentally sit on. Now inside, it's warm. For sure it's warm. So, uh, yeah, that's nice. I like that. Okay, that's all right. Um, 
I'm going to wear this today because today it is currently, uh, I don't know what the temperature is. Hey, Google, what's the temperature outside? In Hansford, it's currently four degrees. Four degrees. So I'm just going to wear this today. Um, and uh, because I bought this again for our trip to Alaska and I didn't want to buy it because we're going in July. I didn't want to buy it like in June or July because how do you test it before you go, right? It's going to be like 20 something degrees here. But when you're there, not going to be that temperature. It's going to be colder and wetter and something warm that you can put layers on, which this is, is going to be important. So I'm going to wear it today and uh, I'll let you know how it did uh, in just a couple seconds. All right, I'm going to, I'm going to go wear this. All right, guys, so we're outside. Uh, you can see, I think you can see, I just got my Insta360 out here. Uh, still winter, but it's uh, definitely warmer. So I'm going to see if I can find a place to put this to show you guys kind of like what this looks like. Um, it's barren out here. Now, the one nice thing I have to say, um, it's surprisingly warm actually i was wearing it inside and it was actually maybe a little little too warm and uh, i wear hoodies and that inside all the time so that's okay so let's see if i can find somewhere to mount this and uh give you guys a a little overview of it just so you guys can see it full full length all right hold on all right so i don't know how much of me you guys can see but you should be able to see enough so yeah, pocket-wise, it's actually, I wouldn't mind if the zippers came down a little bit further. It's kind of like you got your hands up high, but it's fine. Fine, I would have liked to see them maybe come down a little bit more. Not too bad though. Um, so they work, they're large for sure. Uh, these zippers though, awesome. The zippers themselves seem to work really well. Uh, I haven't put a pen in here, but it does have it. So again, I think that's cool. Uh, one of the things I am looking forward to, I have to say, is as much as I do love thumb holes, right? Thumb holes, I do like them. Um, I almost wish that, because there, like there's a lot of, a lot of space in here, like wind, you can feel it, like wind kind of shoots up there. So it would be nice to have something that, either these were like elastic, so they were tighter, or a Velcro strap or something to be able to get those cleaner. Um, fit wise though, I think it's good. Like it fits true to size, which is cool. Uh, the hood's okay. It's big enough, right? You can really kind of get that where you need it to. Uh, this little brim thing, I have no thoughts. I have no thoughts. It is what it is. I think it's it's fine. Again, I would like to have seen like a pull cord or something to kind of get this here. But I think we're going to see all those things on the uh, bear skin, I think it's called. Uh, and those may be why or some reasons why it's worth, you know, twice the amount of this. Back pocket, cool. Got a lot of a lot of space. No no concerns there for space. And uh, it's not it's not very heavy. It's not a heavy sweater, you know. But a day like today, I would probably actually want to wear a uh, long sleeve shirt under this, just to get it to be a little bit warmer maybe but you know what 60 bucks it's not too bad i don't think it's okay now again we are waiting for the other ones the bear skins to arrive so we'll give you our thoughts on that when it when it shows up and we'll, we'll put the two of them uh up against each other i guess hopefully the bear skin gets here while it's still cold out so Plus four right now. It's not cold, cold, but it's uh, perfect for this kind of this kind of outfit. All right, guys, that's it. Uh, I will put links down to this one. If you guys were interested in it, uh, I'm pretty sure there's all kinds of different names, right? It just they're just rebranded because of course they don't have a branding or anything like that on them. It's fine, whatever. All right, guys, uh, <laughs> I have to I have to clean this. It's a little on the dirty side. Yeah. Anyways, links down below. Like, comment, share, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. And we'll see you guys tomorrow. Later.